I've been playing TF2 for a long time, and over that time I spent playing, I feel like I've picked up quite a lot of weird habits in the game, so today I basically want to expose myself and talk about what those weird habits are. I make them sound a lot worse than, than they are, there's nothing really weird in here, but it sounds better. I also want to do this type of video with the weird habits that you guys have, so make sure you comment them down below what weird habits you have picked up since playing TF2, and also make sure you subscribe down below if you're not already subbed, it would mean a lot, and I'm literally trying to double my sub count this year, so we're almost there. Anyway, the first habit that you might have noticed in my videos and stuff like that, because this one is like the biggest one, and that is that I swap weapons constantly. I have no idea why I do it, but when I'm running between places on the map, I'm constantly swapping between all three of my weapons, and a lot of the time it actually gets me killed, because I'm running around, an enemy jumps me, and I've got my, like, pistol or my bat out instead of my scattergun, so I really need to stop doing it. And in fact, I think I have actually reduced the amount I do that recently, but I always seem to catch myself swapping between weapons super quickly when nothing else is really going on. I'm not sure why I do it or why I started doing it. I think it was back when I was trading when nothing was going on and I was super bored. So I just flicked between them. So something was happening on my screen. But now I just keep doing it and I can't stop doing it. So yeah, I'm going to lie and say that it actually helps me stay locked into the game. It probably doesn't. But you know what? That's the excuse I'll use. Another thing that I started doing on streams more recently is that whenever I'm waiting for something to happen or I'm on the menu screen and nothing is really going on, I always click into my backpack and either sit on the first page or just randomly click around to pages in my backpack that don't really have a whole lot to look at on them. It's another thing that I have no idea why I do it, but I do it. I think in my mind I'm doing it for the people who are watching my streams so there's at least something to look at while we're waiting for a game because the menu screen of TF2, we've all seen it, we've all probably sat at it for at least a couple of hours so we don't really care that much about it. It's quite a boring thing to look at. So if I'm clicking through my backpack instead, the screen is changing, stuff is going on and you know it's something a little bit different to look at. Sometimes though it does look like I'm trying to just like flex my inventory which isn't why I do it. I just can't sit on the menu screen and not do anything. I feel like I always need to do something when I'm on stream else you know I'll feel bored and everybody else will feel bored. I, I don't know. Another weird habit that I have is I only really play a couple of maps. Like I default to stuff like Sujin, Harvest, Bad Water and a couple of others. But I've been trying more recently to diversify what kind of maps I play. Not only to keep me more interested in the game and so I don't burn out or anything like that. But also to try and make the videos more interesting to look at. Since you don't really want to watch me play Scout on the same maps over and over again. But me playing Scout on a bunch of different maps over and over again. That I'd love to see. In fact, I probably could say the same thing with classes too. I play Scout, Soldier, Sniper, and a little bit of Demo Man, and they're basically the only classes I actually play. So I want to try and change up the maps a little bit to the maps I normally play, and I want to try and change up the classes a little bit from the classes I normally play. Whether or not that happens from this point forward is a completely different story, but that is my goal, and yeah, it just might not happen. I was definitely a little bit better at this a few months ago when we were still trying to hit 100k. I think I was playing like a whole bunch of different stuff than what I normally was doing before that. And I kind of want to get back to that because I had a lot of fun and I feel like you guys enjoyed the variety in the videos, you know? Like it wasn't just Harvest for the fifth video in a row where I don't even know if the gameplay I was using was the same as the day before that or not because it all looks the same. Alright, I'm not sure if anybody else does this next one or if anybody else can kind of relate to me here. But a habit that I kind of got into recently, especially when I'm not playing very well, would be that I constantly swap between classes that I feel comfortable playing, trying to get a couple of kills before deciding that that is the class that I actually want to play that game. Like if I just run out and die a couple of times as one class, I don't really want to play them anymore. If I go out as one class, get a couple of kills, I'll play them for a little bit longer because that feels like the only thing that works that game. I'm not 100% sure that actually counts as like a habit. It's more just a thing I do when I get a little bit tilted. But do you know what? I think it fits in the video, so I'm going to leave it in. And the final weird habit that I'll talk about in today's video is that I, I just don't go to the objective if I have a kill streak of like seven. I don't know where the number seven has come from, but for some reason, if I'm on a good kill streak, like six, seven, eight kills or something like that, I never go to the objective. 
Now, I'm not sure if it's because I don't want to stand on a point to potentially get killed and lose my kill streak, or if it's because I'm actually just trying to hunt down more kills for some reason, getting a little bit distracted, not really paying too much attention, and, you know, just trying to get 20 kills. It could be a mix of both. Part of me is being careful, but part of me is just being greedy for kills. Recently, I've absolutely loved trying to get as high a kill streak as possible, especially because over the last few months, I feel like I've improved at TF2 quite a lot because I've been playing TF2 quite a lot. And in the future, I do kind of want to make videos like Muzelk used to do where he goes for 20 kill streaks because a lot of people have asked me to do stuff like that. And I feel like if I do want to keep getting better at the game and like a whole bunch of different classes, challenging myself like that would help a lot. Whether or not it turns into like a series of videos on my channel or just something I do on stream is a completely different story again, but it's something that is fun to try and do. Anyway, that is going to do it for the video, guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you want me to talk about your weird habits, then please let me know in the comments what those would be. I won't judge you too much. Maybe I'll judge you. I have no idea. I guess it really depends what it is. If you do some really weird things in this game, then yeah, that would be interesting. <laughs> Anyway, if you're new around here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And if you enjoyed, make sure you leave the video a like. It means a lot. And I love seeing that you guys enjoy the content I'm putting out. It means a lot. And honestly, it makes my day every time I read a nice comment. So yeah, I appreciate you. Anyway, thank you for watching to this point of the video if you did. And I will see you all next time. Goodbye.